Good afternoon. TomFocusArts.com. Okay. Most of the time when you're looking at work, you're not talking out loud, although you could. It could be after a hard day. You just come home and there it is. You're in the bathroom and there it is on your wall. You turn to the right. And what is that shaft of yellow? Well, again, I was born and raised a Catholic. All that means is I'm aware of another dimension. That's all. Of course, you can be aware of another dimension without being a Catholic. That's not what I'm saying. So I was touched by that uh, from being young on the positive side. That there are things there that are very real, more real than the fact that I'm standing here. You can argue with me, that's fine. Why argue about it? I see figures. Maybe the 12 apostles plus others. Maybe it's not the Last Supper. Maybe it's the first gathering. And if I say, oh, it's water, sky, figures, although they're not totally real, are they? It's the spirit, maybe, of the figures being touched by the, this yellow light. So when you're buying original work, it better move you and you better see a story in there that changes. And you change that title. I don't have a title for this one. Flip that back over. <clears throat> well, now I'm seeing these little nice shapes in here. And I see some, uh, this white over here and then this across here. Sometimes you flip it over, you're seeing the abstract dynamics, which means the paint on a canvas. So it's got to hang together artistically and aesthetically. That's the big word for art moving you in, a, in that special way. And we've got some nice thing going on here on the border. So you've got to be able to describe the work, feel the color and dynamics of the work, let your eye move around the work. Where do you rest when you look? Right here. That could be like a child or some figure raising a hand. This could be a staff. So once you put a title on it, it kind of shapes the story. And you can play around with other titles. If you bought the work, just Frame it up, do whatever you want to do with that. Don't carve on my work, please. Don't do that, please. I will feel that if you do that. Put it somewhere special where you're going to see it in the entryway when you come home, in the kitchen. This is oil on unstretched canvas. TomBrooksArts.com.